this is being done because when I did my um, MRI, they saw something um, on the lower area of my breast that did not get picked up uh, during my mammograms. And so they are gonna do a biopsy to um, check it out. And um, not really looking forward to this because a biopsy does hurt. They basically go in and they get tissue samples and they talk about it like it's, oh, it's like gonna be a finger prick or a needle prick and we're just gonna take a little bit. The needle that they use for the biopsy is like a tube. So they're actually taking sample out and um, it is a painful process. When I had the first one on my uh, tumor on top of my breast, um, it took a few days before that kind of healed up and it took a while for me to um, not have that sensation of pain in my breast. Uh, I've been working out. I'm on week three of working out and literally just this week is the first time I've been able to do jumping jacks without feeling like um, there was some pain in my breast. So I'm not looking forward to that part of it. But um, the good thing is, is that uh, my breast surgeon has said that basically whether they find uh, out that this is another tumor or not, if it is another tumor, the plan is still the same for me. Um, they're just taking out two tumors instead of one. So that's the good thing is just to get some answers to figure out what this is. Uh, they are going to sedate me, so that's going to be nice. And um, I have my husband here with me who's driving and is in charge of getting me back home. When you're under sedation, you cannot drive yourself, so you have to have somebody with you. But uh, the rest of the day will just be me relaxing and things like that. Um, one of the things about going to MRI is you have to make sure that you have no metal on. Um, so the first time I went, I had my hair with some um, bobby pins in it. I had to take the bobby pins out and stuff. So that's why today I just have it all wrapped up. Um, precious metals like my rings are fine, uh, but you can't have any other kind of metals and stuff on you. Comfortable clothing is key. I have on one of my favorite t-shirts with one of my favorite people on it. Um, I have on a uh, sports bra that's uh, pretty roomy so that um, when this is all done, I can uh, put it on with um, without being uh, uncomfortable. Uh, the good thing about the sports bra too is that if they give you an ice pack or something, it can help keep it on there. And um, one of my amazing friends bought something that I had on my Amazon list for this journey, which is a mastectomy pillow. It is right here. It's a pillow that you can wear around your chest and it straps all the way around and it has these shoulder straps on it too. Uh, it has a little pocket you can put stuff in it, but one of the benefits is that it gives you distance between your breast and your car seat belt. So when we're done and on the way home, I'll wear it to help protect uh, my boob from this missing with it and um, you know when I have my surgery I'll have this with me too so that's what I have for today um, I may um, film again uh, when I'm done just to kind of talk about what it was like and yeah that's it tell you this biopsy was so much less painful than the first one I was anticipating the same amount of pain and um, like on my first one with solace I could basically feel everything that was happening and this one I could feel when they gave me the anesthesia uh, but I could hear when they were running the needle and the drill to get the samples and couldn't feel a thing. It was amazing. So shout out to this team of uh, specialists for this experience. They did a great job. Uh, they gave me sedation, so I'm still a little loopy, uh, which is cool with me. <laughs> I'm just going to head home and rest. I'm gonna finally get something to eat. I haven't eaten since nine o'clock last night because I had to fast. Get something to drink. Could not uh, drink anything either. So uh, gonna eat, gonna drink, gonna 
get in my adjustable bed and rest for the rest of the day. So, hour. Hour day? Yes. Adjustable bed, I meant. Oh, yes, it's it's our adjustable bed. <laughs> and this pillow is amazing. It's keeping me nice and safe and cozy. cozy. And uh, good experience today. Results should come in three to five days uh, to the doctor's office. And then I think once they receive that, then um, we'll finally have a date for surgery. So fingers crossed, all is well. And that we get this knocked out. So, 